Well, so here's where I'm at with this thing, this um, 28 GMC chop top. Uh, you know, I got the uh, frame here that I haven't gotten to start working on yet. I got to get those running board things off and the engine pulled and the steering wheel off, I suppose. But um, but I got both them doors chopped. See there, you can see. Uh, and this is kind of a mock-up now. This is basically like the back of the cab that I put back together. Um, cause it's like, gosh, 20 pieces of metal. You can see it takes all them straps and things like that. Uh, some of them I'm going to leave the way they are. Some I was going to leave those silver rivets I put in it. And then, uh, since the metal welds good, I'm going to do a lot of welding it back together. Um, but there's those, uh, chops, you know, I mean, to get an idea, I guess, um, of how this would all go. It's probably going to be, you know, basically sitting on the ground like this. I mean, this is what it's like in here. I don't know if this even makes any sense. <laughs> but yeah, she's, um, that's basically how it's going to kind of start getting, you know. You, <laughs> but it's pretty little uh, in here. I'm uh, sitting on the ground and I'm trying to put it, I'm going to try to take these here. And drop these, you know, I want to raise it, say, I want to drop this thing over the frame. So, I mean, it's literally going to be, the floor is going to be somewhere up here. It's going to be interesting. <laughs> it's going to be kind of little, to say the least. Anyways, pretty sweet. Them, them uh, welds and the chop turned out pretty good. I'm not worried. I'll grind them down a little bit. Probably do better if I had a gas on my welder, but, Yep. Chopping the top on the 28, trying to put the cab back together. It is uh, slowly coming back, coming back together, as you can tell. It's um, definitely, it, uh, you know, fell apart. It had a lot of wood in it. It fell apart, and I'm just going to put it back together uh, the way I want it, which is suicide doors, uh, chop top, welded back together more, raise the floor up, try to tunnel it so the drive line's coming through there, and... You know, hopefully eventually uh, get a, maybe a Toyota frame uh, for the Toyota rear end and the engine or something. Maybe put 350 in it eventually or something. I don't know. Plan. I don't know where I'll get with any of these, but a little bit every day and we'll see. <laughs>